How are you today? Officer Davis, nice to see you again. Have a seat for me, if you would, bud. Thank you. Uh, thanks again for coming in and visiting with me. Um, kind of to get things going this morning. What what we're going to do is uh, we're going to do an eye detect, which is uh, a truth verification instrument that we're using. Okay, it's pretty new technology. We're pretty proud of it. Uh, it's pretty accurate. Pretty accurate little instrument that we use in correlation with our polygraph. Well, this instrument measures the dilations of your pupils, uh, the microscopic dilations of your pupils when you lie. When you're telling the truth, you don't really have to think about it, right? But when you lie about things, you have to think about what it is that you're, you're going to say as you make it up, right? When that happens, your pupils dilate, and you don't even know that it's happening. Uh, before we do that, though, I'm going to have you sign a consent form, uh, because as with all parts of our process, you're voluntarily going to take it, right? Um, as we get going, uh, the first thing we're going to do is calibrate this instrument to you. After we get that calibration set up, it's going to start into the exam part. It'll, the machine's actually going to talk to you, uh, and it'll go through our, our disqualifiers. So one thing that you're going to see is you're going to see questions about terrorism, right? The more important thing that it's going to ask you about is disqualifying activities. It's going to ask you about falsifying information on your application. It's going to ask you about your drug usage, your violence tendency type things, you know, those, those type of questions. All those are true false questions, okay? When you get started to the true false questions, um, just like I've labeled the mouse true and false, uh, left click is true, right click is false, okay? You're a male, let's see, you're, you're 37, right? Yep. Okay. Some college, what would you say your reading level is? Is it low, medium, high? What's medium. your medium? Okay. You wearing contacts today? No. All right. I can obviously see that you're not wearing glasses. Take a picture of you, and then it's going to continue on. Again, it's going to connect to this eye detect, which is a sensor here at the bottom of the the screen. Um, so go ahead and if you'd put your chin in that chin rest, is that, once you get your chin in there, just tell me if that's high enough for you, if it's comfortable. It's comfortable. Okay. Alright, so if you just follow that dot with your eyes, All right, so uh, from this point on, I'm going to let you run the mouse. Um, just continue through the exams as it, as it prompts you to, okay? okay? So I'll let you have the mouse and just hit continue and, and go through it. Thank you for your participation. The live detection test is about to begin. First, you will see a presentation of the test topics. Second, you will take a practice test. Then you will take the lie detection test. The city of Kent has discovered that some job candidates may have ties to subversive groups involved with terrorism, while others have engaged in other inappropriate activities that would disqualify them from employment. This is a lie detection test to determine if you have been involved in these activities that would disqualify you from employment with the city. First, the city of Kent is concerned that some job candidates have personally been involved with a foreign terrorist organization. This includes the Islamic State in Iraq and Syria, or ISIS, Al-Qaeda, Boko Haram, the Haqqani Network, or other terrorist organizations with operatives in the country. Second, we have discovered that some applicants have used illegal drugs have committed serious crimes as an adult or have falsified information on their job application. To be clear, you will be disqualified if you have used illegal drugs. 
if you have been involved with a terrorist organization or if you have been involved in any of these disqualifying activities, please inform the test proctor now. You have just reviewed the test topics. The practice test will now begin. Then, you will take the lie detection test. Okay, so so the test is done. Uh, you want to? Is there any confessions or anything you want? You want to talk about anything before we get going here? No. Okay. No confession of guilt. Okay. So from this point on, we're just going to go through the personal history statement, give you the opportunity to talk to, about, talk to me about anything that you need to talk to me about, um, anything that we got to get off your chest kind of before we go to a polygraph phase uh, down the road, okay? Okay. All right.